Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I'm here with the second part in my little Kaleidos mini-series. Um, I don't know like what to call it, it's just doing makeup with the Kaleidos things. So if you want to know more about the series I will leave my first part up here because I don't want to like struggle to say everything I said about this series in this video. But I am doing a look with all of the palettes one by one and pair them with one of the new highlighters. And this is part two, so of course I'm using Futurism 2, that is the Cyber Bronze one. And it looks like this, if you didn't know. And the highlighter I am thinking about using for this look is Star Surfer. It looks like this. I, It's not as pink might look maybe I can swatch it just like got a little hint of pink but it's not like super pink I hope you can see it so I f hope it will go, go good with this look so yeah we're just getting we are just getting started so I'll just zoom in and we get started with part two in this Kaleidos series Okay, so for this look I'm actually thinking about doing like an all shimmer look and only use these three shades. This red one is one of my absolute favorite shades. So I think I'm going to do an all shimmer look. I do it sometimes and I really like it. So I will start with... It's a little bit struggled with the mirror. I will start with this one and put it on my outer crease and I will use one of Kaleidos brushes and this is S2 and if you didn't know I received this in PR the highlighters and I am so happy to be on Kaleidos PR list it feels so amazing so I got the highlighters in PR and it is so... I love that they are coming out with new products. Because they do such good makeup. So I don't know if this maybe isn't possible to... Blend out. I have done some only shimmer looks before and I feel that you have to like... Pack it on on the lid and then like try to blend it out in the crease and the more you blend like the lesser shimmery <laughs> the shadow gets so you like blend away the most shimmer of it and then I think it works better but it's not like the best I know but I think this goes and then I will take the red one this this is one of my absolute favorite shades. I think I s said it in the beginning. This, I think it's a pretty good dupe for Swan. Swan, 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 Swan. From Kat Von D. And this shade is like... It's so pretty. It is a little bit of struggle to do like a good crease or like a good fade in the crease but I feel that I like just have to live with it not being perfect. It feels like they are good to blend into each other. That is like the easiest part with shimmer shades, I feel. They are super easy to blend into each other, so that is good. And now I don't know what's happened here and here. So like that I think it's pretty okay. And then I will go in with the silver shade and this shade... This is like rise. Crazy pigmented, and I really love 
that it is silver in this palette and not gold because it feels like gold would have been like a normal thing the obvious thing to put in this palette so I love that it is silver in this I'm putting silver over the red but I don't want too much over the red and then I go in with the red again and like put it a little bit over the silver make the blend a little bit like smoother so I actually think something like this I don't know though if I want to go out over with like a clean brush I will go in with a brush that don't have any pigment on it even though it looks like it have and just like smooth the edge a little bit I don't know if it, it will help but so I will take away the fallouts fix my base but not my highlighter so we test this out my first impression together so I will take away the fallouts fix my base and my brows and then I come back and we do the highlighter and the under eyes together so the face is almost on we're just going to dig into the star surfer and I'm using the brush and I'm going a little bit more I'm going to be a little bit more careful so it looks like this and then like this so I'm taking uh, the brush and just dip it in a little bit and then okay, this feels I guess that they are like two different formulas in their highlighters because this wasn't as like <laughs> bam in your face as the other one I used in first part or maybe I just didn't dig that much this time but I really like this I like that it has like a little pink hint but it's not like too crazy with a pink highlighter I don't know if you can see it because I don't know how to show a highlighter I don't know if I have a flash to it oh my I don't know if you can see it but it's so freaking shimmery and this looks so cool I don't know if you can see this this looks awesome so I will just spritz my face and okay for my under eyes I think I will go in with the red one and put it on my whole lower lash I don't know how to like film this so you can see the best and this red is like the most amazing shade ever okay so I will put on mascara some lip and something in my waterline and then I come back and have my first little review or my first impression of the star surfer highlighter so i'll fix everything and then i will come back so i am back with the finished look for my what line i used kicker from colourpop haven't used this before and on my lips i used brink from colourpop that is lipstick and yeah this is the finished look and i like the look but <laughs> It's not like a favorite, but I wanted to do an all shimmery look. And the Star Surfer, I think I like this more than the Solar Sailor. This feels a little bit more toned down, but it's still really there. I don't know if 
it is different formulas. I don't know, but because this Star Surfer is called NO2 and this is GO3 and three of them are GO and two of them, three of them are NO, so I don't know if it is two different like lines of highlighters, but I really like this one. I feel that it's like it's pink, but it's not super pink. And I like it. I really hope that you can see it. I am so bad at showing off highlighters on my channel, if we say it like that. But yeah, this was my part two of this little mini Kaleidos series. I don't know when the next part will come up. I have at least one other video that I have to put up. A certain no, two. But I will try to not like drag this out. So yeah, I really hope you liked this video. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos. And I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!